Good afternoon, everybody. Paulie from Paulish Custom Skins. So today we're going to be merging my traffic mods on ATS into one file, basically. I've had a couple of people ask me to do this, and I haven't managed to get around to it. So I thought I'd do a quick video on it as well at the same time, so people can see how easy it is to do with Mod Studio. So what I've created, I've just put uh, a few of the, the traffic mods that have gone on ATS into a folder. As you can see here, these have all been made with Mod Studio. Uh, I do have the a, a videos, obviously, different videos on how to use Mod Studio. So, what you'll do is you'll go to New Project, ATS Mod Project, ATS. You'll start your project, Template, exist, Existing Mod, like we've got here. We'll then pick the one we've picked. Uh, let's go that. So then we'd start at the top. So we do the case one, like so. Mm -hmm. Then we go the next one, which is the Chevy Express vans, like so. Then you'll click it again, add templates again. And then you'll click drinks vans. We'll put another template again. I'll give the next one, JCB pickups, and so on, and so on, and so on. Uh, I do believe there's no limit on this, but I think I would say perhaps keep it to like 10, maybe 10 existing, 10 of your mods, keep them about that size, I would have thought. Just try it with that. If you want to try it bigger than that, then try it bigger than that. But um, I'd say just keep it to 10 if you can. So you do all that. That's all you got to do with those. Then get your manifest. Fill your manifest in there you want to fill it in. Like so, I'll just put paint job and AI traffic. Put in what you want to put up here. Obviously, the ear icon. I'd make I'd made this icon here, which you can see there. That's the icon I'd made. Uh, the manifest, sorry. So we've got the manifest in there. So you then export the mod. Like so. Now you can export it straight to your mod folder if you want to, which I've done there save like so uh, and then if you want to export it to your steam workshop folder so my steam workshop folder let me show you if i just go back i've got that on one of my drives I'm, i've got a, a special so a special folder that i made ready for steam workshop so just open that up there's all the skins i've got on the steam workshop just right click, make yourself a folder. Just name your folder what you want to name it. We've named it the big traffic pack. Don't have to put nothing else in it. Just leave, just make the folder and that's it. Just leave it like that. Then export mod Steam Workshop. Like so, you'll click the folder you want. Like so, you'll click that. Just press select folder and mod sheet, mod sheet or do his thing. So I've already done all that. We'll just get rid of that for now. Uh, what you can do is, once you've done what you want to do with Mod Studio 2, press Save. And then just uh, Big Traffic Pack. So that's saved if you want to go back to it and add any more mods later on. Press Save. So that'll save you. See there, Project Saved. And there we go in the folder where we've had all the mods from. So that'll be saved there for you. So you can go back to that later on if you need, if you want to add more mods to that a bit later. So we'll get rid of that. We'll get rid of that. Right, so I've started the Steam Workshop uploader up. You'll select American Truck Simulator. And make sure that says new. You'll click here and pick the files you want to pick, which is the Steam Workshop. And then this one, like so. You'll then pick your workshop picture that you need which is 640 by 360 there is on the mod studio 2 uh we do have a pack uh, we do have a a card that tells you all the sizes that you need and i do believe it does tell you on much studio as well somewhere i might be wrong but it, yeah but it is, yeah so anyway go back to the same workshop so you've got your your file there, you've got your workshop image there. Fill that in there, you want to fill it in, whatever you want to put. Make sure that's a public. Put all your information in there, what you want to put in there, all the different things. 
uh, and then go over here for AI traffic, I'll just put paint jobs, uh, just put with the brands, and all you do is press upload, let it do its stuff. I see, no, I said, no, I said, don't worry about that. Press continue. And then I'll upload now to the Steam Workshop. Like so. There we are. So that's successfully uh, uploaded. So that's now available on the Steam Workshop to be used by people. So we'll open Steam Workshop up. Make a truck simulator. Let's find more files. Let's go on. Your workshop files. There we go. Look. Big traffic pack is uploading into the Steam Workshop. And there we have it. And that's what you do if you want to put all your files together in one pack and upload them to the Steam Workshop. You can do it as easy as that. Now, obviously, you you use whatever software you want to use to make your skins and whatever. Uh, obviously, I use Affinity Design, which you all know. Um, regarding Mod Studio 2, I've got plenty of tutorials on how to use Mod Studio 2 from a few years back to obviously recently I've started updating the, the video so you can all see how it is easy to use Mod Studio 2. Uh, as always, I'm thankful for everybody's support as always when I get off everybody through the comments and, and whatnot. So of course, don't forget to subscribe, like and share. And if you're going to see any comments you want to make on this video, then please do so. If you want to come and join me in my Discord, then come and say hello in my Discord. If you've got any problems, come and talk to me in my Discord. I can, I'm easy enough to talk to most days, to be fair. Uh, if I'm not there, I've got my good friend Pups in there as well. Uh, so, yeah, if you've got any problems, you can come and have a chat. Other than that, as always, thank you again for everything. And I will speak to you on the next video. Take care. Have a good day.